Hello guys, welcome to the Model Alley. How to build your Model Alley series. I'm not sure what part we're on, but I know it's um, quite high now, I think. Just going to check into recent videos. So my recent upload, How to Build Your Model Alley series, in parts, I think this one, was part 12. So part 13 will go up probably later today if I've got time. If not, it will go up tomorrow. So, that's that. I am going to just basically um, do some scenery. I'm just be back in a second my body. Um, so it's corn nature. It's been one of those days my body has been steady recently. Big box for stones, which I got from home base for my layout because obviously I've just got big packs of stones in here. It's quite heavy. It's stone sashes, they're not anything else. Meow. It's only stone sapling, it's not for kitty cats going. This is for my lap. Not for cats to go take the toilet in It's not for kitty cats where you passed. Wait, not for kitty cats. That's for the, the stone that way. You can't have it. I'm not in it. None of my stones. Anyway, guys, I will You're not going out there. Those are for my layout, not for Miss Key Cats like you. Right, so anyway, how to build your one of those scenery part uh, I will have a look, I'm not going to guess what part it is, but because I'll see 17, 18, 19. So this one will be part 20 once I'm done and the second one of this lot will be part 21, 22 and then Monday will be part 23 and 4 and 5 so yeah it's going to be a bunch of different stuff so I'm sort of trying to get up there 
It's not for key cats to play with. What we doing to this model? Eh? Doing a bunch of scenery, um, tidying it up properly, and just laying it all down properly once I am at that point. So right now, when I got all this to deal with, um, yeah, it's just basically what I'll do now. It's just to work on something really cool, but. Obviously things like this will take time. There we go. Got a bunch of scenery in that um, X cake pot thing. So yeah, there's plenty of stuff that's going around. Right, we're going to do some more work today with the scenery. Uh, what are we doing for today? Um, we're not doing a lot for today because obviously big percentage is going to be done when I'm not filming. I know you guys probably want to see some of this, but maybe there's the other half you're probably not so worried about it. But yeah, I can't please everyone. As I like to say a lot, I can't always please everyone. So too many of you to please all the time. Yeah. Also make sure you comment, like and subscribe and turn on post notifications. And you can find me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook and Twitch and TikTok. Uh, links to all the download and description for all those. But yeah, the How to Build Your Runaway series is going to come a big thing dream from now to December, well, right until February actually. Um, so yeah, it's going to be a little while of stuff, but obviously being at, um, I'm focused on a very small section of the layout for this evening, because obviously I'm limited to time tonight. I've still got a few things to do before bed. I thought I was going off, you know, the gentleman's toilet. I'll edit that bit out. <laughs> yeah. Definitely editing that out. Anyway, um right. This needs to go into here. I think we've done enough feeling for this one. But also we need to push it back right back. That is there. What have we got now? We've got the scraper, but we haven't got the brush. So we need the brush next to tidy that area up now. The brush is at the other end of the layout. Which is not unusual at all. You're gonna, do you ever get a day when you feel like I don't know what to do with stuff half the time. My mine's been today. Yeah, I'm wearing a shirt, nice colourful shirt today because it's colder and second me it's because nice to wear in winter. I wouldn't wear these in summer, it's just too hot for them. I prefer the cold to the hot. I prefer the cold to the hot a lot of the time because obviously it does mean putting layers on in some way, but yeah, it's just, you know. Is what it is when you're having a takeaway tomorrow, which would be nice. I haven't had one of those for so long. It'd be gorgeous to actually have one for a change. I do like takeaways every now and again. I would quite happy to every day. I'm not sure my body was, but 
Me personally, I walk right up here. Have them every day. Yeah, I wouldn't because obviously, well, I think I might look like a hippo if I did. Hmm. So yeah, there's a bunch of scenery I'm adding to this layout. Just popping my butt down for a minute. Uh -oh. I usually have a lazy day on a Saturday, but I think this weekend it's going to have to be on Sunday. Obviously because I'm now going out in the evening for a kebab. And the chicken one's always good. And obviously being in the local area for that one, it's really nice anyway. It could all change obviously because we haven't been there for quite some time. But I doubt it will change that much in that space of time. Do I have a favourite Joe to write? Yes, I do. I like the cherry and glitterberry one, which only comes out around Christmas time. And it hangs around till Easter, but 